point that resonated with me was related to uh, the government capacity. And when it comes to, because middle income countries or even low income countries, we are trying to solve the problems of the world when I'm thinking about energy transition and sustainable development and climate by being centers of uh, energy technologies, uh, mining strategic and critical minerals for to win that energy transition of the world, um, trying as much as possible to mitigate and adapt to, uh, to climate change, while at the same time, we can see it every day. I mean, our, our agriculture sector is, is suffering today because we had the worst drought in, in 40 years in Morocco. The question really today is how to ensure that those governments, especially for those countries like, like us and others, who have tried to regionalize decision-making processes as much as possible and investment-making decisions as much as possible, are able, in an increasingly complex world, to, um, to ensure that whatever economic system you're building at the local level or at the federal level is equipped to manage climate, pollution, uh, Morocco, we are, um, we are also uh, president of United Nations Assembly for the Environment. And one of the things that we've, that we've been very uh, conscious about is this issue around plastic pollution. Um, it's perverse, it's everywhere, it's ubiquitous, it's the most important ubiquitous pollution that you can get. Every person in hell or in, ingests between one and five milligrams of microplastics and nanoplastics every week. So equivalent of a credit card. And we have that in our body.